Well, thank you for watching this video. Uh, on this video, I'm going to show you how to add messages to customer on invoice and footer text on invoice. So let's get started. So I'm going to go to QuickBooks Online. Here's a QuickBooks Online. So just open uh, uh, any invoice. It's a blank invoice or or already uh, a recent invoice. So from here, as you can see here, here's a message displayed in here. You don't want to type it every time you create invoice. So you can uh, set up uh, uh, this one is an uh, uh, in, in invoice template. So just click the uh, the new gear here. This is the style gear. It's different than the uh, uh, the company gear. Is the middle one here. So this is the one. So let's click that gear, and then at the bottom you'll see customize what your customers see. Click that one. All right. And it's uh, the setting is on design now. This change to content. And on the right side, you will see uh, pencils, pencils icon, pencil icon in here. So the one you want to see, you click is this one in here. You know, hopefully you can see it right here. Click it, and then on the left side, then you will show you uh, whatever you want to write your message. In this case, I have a thank you for your business, and the footer text. You can write whatever you want. Uh, you know the message, uh, whatever message you want to write down. For normally, it would be like your company uh, ID or uh, follow us on Twitter, New QBO, or uh, visit our website, newqbo.com, something like that. All right, so save and exit. Okay, so now if I create a new invoice, let's create one invoice in here. Okay, I'm gonna save this. All right, as a printer preview, as you can see here, right here, here's the message. Thank you for your business. And at the bottom, you'll see put a note like this one in here. All right. So you have to create this put a note uh, if you use a different uh, uh, template. So in this case, I'm just using this one. So if you switch to another one, then you all have to make sure they also have a, a footer message as well and a message displayed on the invoice. Anyway, I uh, hope this video is helpful to you. And uh, if you don't want to use it from here, you can always use it uh, from your company gear. I'm just going to close this. That's the old way. See the upper right corner from the home page screen? Just click that one. And the custom form styles, it will take you to the same place actually. And in, in, in this demo file, I have a whole bunch of templates. So just click the, your template, edit one, and it takes you to the same place again, right here. So uh, it's much easier to do it directly from your, uh, uh, from your uh, uh, invoice sales form. So anyway, uh, thank you for watching. And you can visit our website. Here's our one page screen here newqbo.com newqbo.com uh, you know we have all kinds of helpful tips and uh, our, our website is up to date so visit our website or uh, and subscribe uh, our YouTube channel thank you bye